So data is sitting at $6.1, $6.18. You can call it $6.2 almost. Dot, uh, as long as it stays above $6, Dot can start its journey towards the 6.8, which is its resistance. Its support is 6.12, but I will call it 6 just to round it up. And this is in a very, very tricky place. It is like Cardano. I think these, these two blockchains, they kind of go hand in hand, even though this is layer one, and I forgot what is Cardano. But it is sitting literally on its support, very close to its support. So I would expect DOT to hold this support and start its journey towards 6.8 instead of going down. But if it breaks this area of $6 and go, goes below it and starts living there, as I've mentioned in my other videos, I make 10 videos a day. If you're not subscribed to my YouTube, you wouldn't know, but I'm not going to repeat. I've explained how a support and resistance is broken. And I've, I think I've covered it in the other days as well. If it goes below it and starts living there for more than eight hours, then we will consider that the support is gone. Otherwise, the support holds, it is staying above it. It has not spent even four hours below it. This candle is four hour candle and it's still running, which means it hasn't lived below it. This is bullish. This is holding strong and I would expect it to go towards 6.8 instead of breaking the support. If you ask me which direction I have to pick, I'll pick the upside instead of a downside. 